Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, my name is Stephen Levin. I'm the chair of the Council's General Welfare Committee. Uh, first, I would like to give a warm welcome to our newest member of the General Welfare Committee, Council Member Adrian Adams from Queens. Welcome, 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 welcome. <laughs> this morning, we're also joined by members of the committee. Councilmember Annabel Palma of the Bronx, Councilmember Barry Grudenchik of Queens, Councilmember Vanessa Gibson of the Bronx, myself from Brooklyn, only member of Brooklyn that's here. <laughs> I will also be joined, I believe, by Councilmember Margaret Chin, who is the lead sponsor of Intro 1062A. Today, the, count, the committee will be voting on 1062A, sponsored by Councilmember Margaret Chin, in relation to requiring a study on the feasibility of providing language classes to certain children in the foster care system. When we first heard this bill in December of 2016, we heard testimony about a child who was removed from parents who did not speak English as their primary language, placed with a foster family, and that parent subsequently lost, or that child subsequently lost her language skills, render, rendering her unable to communicate with her family. Council Member Chin has pushed this issue in order to protect other children in foster care from experiencing the same unfortunate loss, and I want to thank her for her focus on this very important issue. Council Member, uh, Council, Council Member Chin has moved uh, ACS to make this a priority and to come up with a plan to address this serious problem. Um, I uh, am going to ask Council Member Chin when she arrives to make a, a statement about this legislation and I am uh, asking my <coughs> colleagues to vote yes on this very important, important bill. And um, uh, I can ask um, uh, William Martin, clerk to the committee, to call the roll. And, uh, and then uh, I believe uh, Margaret will keep, the, will keep it open for a customer to uh, make a statement. Roll call vote committee on general welfare. Introduction 1062A, Chair Levin. I vote aye. Palma. Gibson. I too want to welcome our newest colleague, Councilmember Adams, and want to congratulate Councilmember Chen on a very important piece of legislation, and I vote aye. Gordenchik. You know, Mr. Chair, it's nice to not go last anymore, so uh, <laughs> just for that, I'll vote aye. Thank you. Welcome, Adrian. <laughs> Thank you. Adams. I vote aye. I vote a five in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstention. Item is adopted by the committee. Okay, we'll leave the roll open as well. Okay, and uh, and I also want to thank uh, General Welfare Committee staff for working on this legislation. Andrea Vasquez, Senior Counsel, Tanya Cyrus, Senior Policy Analyst, Daniel Krupp, Legislative Finance Analyst, Financial Analyst, and Doheny Sampora, Finance Unit Head. Okay, we'll leave the we'll leave the roll open. 